Hi, I'm Ray and welcome to Ray's Tech. And in today's video, we're gonna be talking about the Stuya Zigbee Smart PIR Sensor. With this smart motion sensor, I can create automations that can light up any dark room or way without even touching the switch. This automation is extremely helpful when you need to carry things down the stairs like laundry or bags. Later in this video, I will show you how I install it to turn on or off our light on our stairs. So without further ado, let's get started. First, let's unbox and set up this Tuya Zigbee Smart PIR sensor. Here is the box that came with the sensor. You will see the picture and some text about this device. Inside the box, you'll have the smart motion sensor itself and a manual. The design is good and it's quite bigger than what I already have here in my house even without the stand. On the front, this is where the motion sensor is located. On the side, you will see a button for pairing and resetting this device and a light indicator. The nice thing about this motion sensor is it comes with a stand which can be turned in different directions to give you different angles when you stick it on the wall. It also can be removed if you don't need it. To set up this device, we're gonna need a hub. I have here a Tuya Smart Wireless Sigby Gateway. Now let's open the Smart Life app. Look for the hub and click on it. Click the Add Subdevice button here. To pair this device, press the reset button for 5 to 7 seconds until the light indicator is blinking rapidly. Then click the LED already blink. Once the PIR sensor is detected, click done. You can rename it here if you want to and select a room where you're gonna place this device. Finally, click done. I'm going to create automations that if the sensor detects movement, the light bulb on our stairs will turn on and if there is no motion detected within a minute, the light will turn off. Now to create an automation, click the smart program. Here on automation, click the plus sign. So we're gonna choose a condition, just click when device status changes. Select the PIR sensor, click state, then select the motion detection. Now to set up the task, click run the device. Find and select the stairs light. Click switch, select on, then click save. Since this bulb is a colored light bulb, we're gonna set the color temperature to 1000 and the brightness to 1000. Click next. I only want this automation to work until before we sleep because there is a glass window on top of our door where the light pass through our bedroom. Since I don't want my wife to wake up in the middle of the night when I go downstairs and the same with me, I don't want to wake up if she's going to the comfort room. I'm gonna set a specific time for this automation to work. Go to effective period, select custom, then select the time when the automation will start and end. Click next and save. Now I'm going to create another automation that runs from 12 to 6.15 a.m. which allows the light to only turn on for the lowest brightness. We already programmed it to turn on the light when it detects movement. Now to turn the stairs light off automatically, 
when there is no motion detected within a minute, we're gonna do the same process but this time we're going to turn the switch off. Press next and save. Now that's the setup and let's go ahead and place the motion sensor and test these automations. That's a Wi-Fi smart bulb and that is where I'm going to place the sensor. Here is the switch. Let's now install the motion sensor. That's it. Now it should catch people coming out through that bedroom door, comfort room, through this door, and if someone is coming up from the stairs. For the price of this device, you can get this here in Thailand for around 299 baht. In the Philippines, you can avail it at around 746 pesos for this product model. But I will put some alternative for this device that is much cheaper in the description below. It is really nice to have a motion sensor like this in our smart home especially for its functionality and convenience that can be given to us. It is not only can turn our lights on or off, but also it can be used as a deterrent or security alarm in our house that will sound the alarm or send a notification on your smartphone when motion is detected in the middle of the night. This device is very cheap but reliable, responsive, a well-performing motion sensor that works really well and it can trigger every 60 seconds the only downside is you do need a hub for this device to work however if you are interested in acquiring sensors then in the long term this is still gonna work out cheaper instead of getting a Wi-Fi version which also sometimes causes delay on your automations now, if you are interested to get one, I'll put a link below where you can get it. If you have any further questions about this 2 Zigbee Smart PIR sensor, leave a comment down below. And if you do enjoy this video, please do me a favor. Give this video a thumbs up as that helps a lot. I am building an affordable smart home. If you want to come along with my journey, and learn to do it by yourself, I hope you consider subscribing. As always, thank you for watching and see you on the next one. Peace.